At RTS, we're equipping students to be expositors of the Word of God. The minister doesn't read his own ideas into the text, but he lets the text speak, and he presents what's in the text to the congregation by the power of the Holy Spirit to the glory of God. So we want to start in, uh, in this course laying a good foundation to cultivate our preaching gifts. We're trying to help students to move uh, from the text to the sermon, not only by employing careful study of the scriptures and uh, devoting themselves to prayer as they prepare their sermons that is useful in opening up the Word of God to their congregation. We use Brian Chapel's Christ-Centered Preaching. Uh, we believe it's a way that ministers can get a foothold into the practice of the preparation and delivery uh, of a sermon. We provide preaching labs uh, so that students will have hands-on practice and receive feedback not only from their homiletics professor, uh, but also from their fellow students. It's so important in our course to focus on the character of the minister. We have our uh, students do things that will help them develop a lifelong habits of devotion and prayer and scripture memorization. It's uh, my uh, firm conviction that uh, preaching is a spiritual work and if the pastor isn't uh, taking the Word of God into his own heart, he is not going to know it or be able to communicate it in a godly, winsome, and passionate way to his congregation. What I enjoy uh, most about introduction uh, to preaching, and I'll just add in all of my uh, classes, is being with the students. I love being a part of their lives, not only studying with them and preparing them for pastoral ministry, but I enjoy our times of fellowship outside the classroom. I love uh, visiting in their homes, sharing meals with them. What a wonderful thing it is to be a part of uh, their, their lives. It's uh, my entire goal here to help uh, these young men look forward to their first year of pastoral ministry. Men can feel overwhelmed when they set foot for the first time on their first church, uh, but I want them from the outset uh, to love pastoral ministry, to love the people of God, to love preaching as much as I do.